Today, Ashley is off work. Uh, we have my mom and my dad here, Randy and Sherry and Loxley, and we're getting ready to go to Philadelphia. <laughs> We finally made it to Philly. We are parked. We're walking down the street. Boston's got her little 1800s bonnet on. <laughs> We're gonna go check out the Elfrith Road. So we're here on Elvis. Is that right, Elvis? Elvis. <laughs> El <laughs> we still, uh, it's hard to pronounce. But we're on this uh, this alley, and Dad uh, is a social studies teacher. He's been a social studies teacher for the last 30 years, and uh, he knows a lot of American history. And Dad, what is what is this uh, alley all about? It's the our nation's oldest residential street. Started in 1702 by Jeremiah Elworth. Nice. And people have lived here since 1702, and they still do today. My understanding is that a lot of these older homes are very narrow and long because they base their taxes on the width of the front of the house. So you would build a very narrow front home that was very long and then your taxes on your home were very small in relation to a wide home. That makes sense. So they have built them really long, really narrow, and we'll flip it around so you guys can see. So like, you know, the, the house is, you know, the width wise, is very narrow, but if you step around the corner, you know, it goes back pretty far. You guys can hit that like button that really help us out and while you're at it go ahead and subscribe that'll also help us out we appreciate it all right now we're going to where dad that's ross's home and she's known for what sewing the first continental flag <laughs> you can get a copy of the Declaration of Independence for $3.99. The Ben Franklin Bear, $19.99. Revolutionary War Bear for $14.99. This Philadelphia on the hat. You can get this bald eagle and he is for $9.99. A handmade bald eagle slingshot for $9.99. You find Ashley? A baby book. How much is it? 
Make sure you subscribe. We post every other day. If you guys have ever been to Philly, what's your favorite thing? Comment down below. What's your favorite thing to do in Philadelphia? somebody's a vlogger. See somebody with a camera talking to it, but then also the rest of the group is way up in front of you, and you gotta play catch up. 